<laughs> hey, folks. Dr. Mike here. Ooh, who am I again? Professor of Exercise and Sports Science at Lehman College in the Bronx, in New York City, in the world, you know, the rest. And also uh, co-founder of Renaissance Periodization and co-creator of our suite of hypertrophy apps and training apps. And I do have an admission to make for you today, to you today. It's an uncomfortable admission, but I think in today's trying political times, fence sitting won't work anymore. It's time for me to take a stand. And I'm going to take a stand by admitting something to you that is uncomfortable for me to admit. Because every day I fight against it. I am mortal. Whew. It's tough. And I am not a god. Now I'm doing everything in my power to engineer my way towards godlike immortality. Why do I tell you this? Because among us, walk the immortals, not just the blade trinity vampires. I'm sure they're around too. Vampires, hello. But true gods, heroes, men of whom word spreads in only one of two ways. Way number one, whispers. I heard he's here. Jealous whispers. He's coming. Rumors. Is he real? No way. And the other way is screaming at the top of the lungs during and by said female in an orgasm experienced by her to the very thought of this god and or if she's very lucky a direct physical experience mike what the f are you on about bro oh but you already know because you saw the thumbnail didn't you there are men and brave men and capable men and strong men and there are gods and kyriakos grizzly is a god. And not just because he's Greek, but that doesn't hurt. You guys remember Hercules? I don't either. Because the strongest man ever from Greece is f***ing Kyriakos Grizzly. Scott the video guy, roll that shit so we can just do one thing together as our little YouTube family. Bask in awe. Let's do it. Oh my god, yes. Oh god. The scale says... You see, folks, that is because how do you weigh godhood? You shudder at its presence. You drop to your knees. Men from fear, women from the kind of inability to contract their lower bodies, I assume is concomitant with a full-bodied orgasm. Ladies, turns out this is a dating tips episode. If you are a woman of reproductive age and, hey, grandma, don't tell anyone I said this, but you too. You're going to want to take notes because I'm going to tell you how to make yourself most available to, I was going to say a man like, that's not true, a god like Kyriakos Grizzly. So, more dating tips ahead. First, if you find yourself a man that steps on the scale and the shit short circuits, I'm not Beyonce, but throw a f***ing ring on that shit. The rumor is that that was a 200 kilogram scale, and I think he was like 212 kilograms when he stepped on this. 212K, that's like <laughs> pushing 470 pounds. It's not a man we speak of. I love everything about it. Also, his body composition, I'm no sports scientist, but I would say he looks to be about 8% fat. I'm in a conversation for 10 to 12% for you naysayers, but like anything north of 14, 15, you're out of your mind. And honestly, just jealous. And I understand. I understand. Look, again, seeing this kind of perfection, it's difficult to wrap the head around. You've been lifting a while. You think you get your swole on, you're kind of, your little fucking small T, your pecs are kind of popping. You're like, damn, dude, I'm on, I on fucking steroids. I don't even know about it. And then and you hear the mere mention of Kyriakos Grizzly and you realize you haven't trained at all. You're a child. You are a child. And so am I. Look at me, I'm Kyriakos. I mean, f big titties. Even if you're a straight dude, which sure I am, <clears throat> you can't resist the shit. And obviously he's jacked and his beard is on point at 100%. <sighs> I can do this, I can do this. Yeah, hell yeah. I don't know what the f that is, <laughs> but it looks dope.
I imagine it to be a shrug done in a way that is designed to maximally inconvenience the setup. Notice that he has tape, clear tape, packing tape around that number of 25s. These are 25 kilo plates, by the way. It's real weight too. You can tell because the bar is bending and he's got little chains there for some extra weight on top. He's zerturing it, which means he's holding into the kind of the, the crevices of his arms. And he's doing a little bit of shrugging, pecs popping, shoulders juicy, face at bloat 100. There's this debate, like what is masculinity? That debate is over. You're looking at it. You want to be more like a man? You put a picture of Kiriakos Grizzly up in your bathroom, which you should already replace the picture you already have up with him, just the new laminated version. And every day before you walk out of that bathroom that you brush your teeth in and shave in and touch your body in the shower to, you tell yourself, Mr. Kiriakos, I will not let you down. And I will try to become much more like you with every single thing I do, starting with Sita Zersher Shrugs. Some of you may be asking, oh, he seems quite tired from that. How come? I thought he was a god. Ooh, good one, folks. But you're not that clever. Scott, you grew up Christian, yes? Sure. Scott, what did God do on the last day uh, after he created the heavens and the earth and man? He rested, my guy. God's rest, folks. 40 chess. Kyriakos is playing with you, with you pussies out here. <laughs> you know, so we're all fighting demons in the gym. And because he's a god, he's fighting like the devil, I assume, or multiple the devils. Um, sometimes you got so much shit in there. And I don't mean clogged arteries. Uh, I mean demons. Uh, that even a hard set of, well, frankly, whatever the f*** that was, just isn't enough to get it all out of the soul. So after you rack, you got some shit in there still, and what better to do than primal scream? <laughs> that guy's like, yeah, I have no idea why I'm celebrating. What, what happened? Did that range of motion exceed one inch finally? <laughs> Okay, honestly, that flexibility is dope. I can't do that shit. He's somehow incredibly obese at 470 pounds and also wildly athletic. What? Oh, damn. I, also, hitting the bodybuilding poses at it, what I would just say, and I, listen, I've been really fat myself before, comical body fat percentage is, well, godlike. Because you could say to yourself, if I were this fat, there's no way I would hit bodybuilding poses because it would be embarrassing. And I understand you as a mortal human, because I am too, unfortunately. That makes sense in your head, logically. Except what to be embarrassed about if you can never die. Good morning with bar dump for no reason. re-racking it. Partial bent row deadlift combo. <laughs> oh, whoever made these videos is having a grand old time. Now, TBH, unless this pick is enhanced, he looks like he like, of course, his uh, body fat's uh, very high, but you know, you don't get traps like that from body fat and uh, delts and pecs and, and arms. Kiriakos got some muscle underneath that motherfucker. And I mean, George Clooney is good looking, but this, a real man, as we say in Russia. Oh, uh, yes. Nothing like bar carries. Oh, and I love the angel wings. <laughs> Someone is having a lot of fun at Kyriakos is neither expense nor benefit. And, you know, like they got one thing, right? He's a f angel, right? Can you imagine you're like you're some little kid? And I don't know, man, this is going to get dark real quick. But like your parents are fighting in the other room and you pray to God and you're like, please send me an angel to help me out of this. And I just want to be in a safe place where I feel safe and get a good night's rest. Amen. And then like the door busts open. And Kiriakos like, you pray for me. Yes, I am Kiriakos. And you're like, why, why yes, sir. He's like, tucks his angel wings through the door. Feathers fall everywhere. He's like, come with me if you want to. You know, I don't know, whatever. Uh, the, in any case, you're going to have a good time. <laughs> Holy shit. 
Now, like full stretch pull-ups with a little athleticism coming up over the bar with the chin at 400 plus pounds is impressive. Like a real talk, Kiriakos Grizzlies lifts are insane and weird and probably not very effective for the amount of fatigue they generate and excessively laborious to set up the gym situation to have them done. He's big and strong and athletic and, and it's a trip. Like, God damn it, you're not supposed to be able to move 400 pounds like that. Why don't you go to Walmart next time, pick someone out who weighs 400, should be easy, and be like, hey, how many pull-ups can you do? They're going to be like, ah, yeah, come on, man, that's not nice. Kyriakos, he's your man. There is no avoiding hard training if you want to grow. But if you want to grow the most, your training needs to be hard and smart. RP Hypertrophy app will make sure you're progressing on track, monitoring, and adjusting your workout at all times. So for all that work you're doing, you can be sure you're getting the best results. Yes, I have an explanation for this. Don't worry, I'm still a scientist. Most people understand that weights are inanimate objects and that they can, you don't understand your emotions because if you scream at them, nothing's happening. Ah, but maybe that's true. And maybe it's just that the weights do understand at a requisite minimum intensity of screaming. And Kyriakos has screamed hard enough directly at them that the weights usually are like, what? Huh? Huh? And this time, Kyriakos is like, ah, ah, and the weight's like, oh, now, yeah, yeah, like, listen, handshake, I know exactly how you feel. Thank you, Kyriakos, for letting me, the weights, know what you're feeling on the inside. And he's like, yeah, respect, I just want to be on the same page. You guys know people, dog whisperers, they can talk to dogs and shit. Kyriakos is a weights whisperer. And that's why he's the f strongest thing that's ever been. Oh, he also <laughs> seems to be yelling at the heater behind him and maybe at the collars too. Sometimes you just gotta let it out. Uh, ladies, imagine that. <laughs> Kyriakos Grizzly exists. And I want you to remember that for a second. I wanna reach out to all the ladies who watch the channel, the three and a half of you that are our fan base. And I want you to be truthful with me right now. Not even me, in the, in the, in the quiet and peace of your own home. Ask yourself a question. Are you having the kind of sex that you want to be having? Like, is the sex you're having like, oh, thanks, honey, that was great. You're so sweet. A little kiss and then turn to sleep. Or is the sex you're having a cosmic karmic experience of full body clasps and releases that leaves you drained and confused and in the shower for 30 minutes, just staring at the bottle of shampoo, barely able to ambulate on your own two legs, wondering how can someone put out such good goddamn loving? Well, if it's not the second variety, there is a problem with an easy solution. The problem you're having is your sex is mystical. And the reason is because you are not having the sex done to you by Kyriakos Grizzly. Ladies, uh, let's all close our eyes together and imagine that chest hair rubbing up against your face as you gasp for the tiny little bit of air he decides you get to have to keep you just awake enough to just disintegrate into a pile of pleasure beneath his 474 rhinoceros-like pounds. Am I erect, you ask? Yes, and I have been for this whole video. Hey guys, if you desperately need more videos of Kyriakos Grizzly and you've already run through all his other stuff and you need my incisive commentary to go along with it, we've got an extended cut. So that could be cool if you were a member. Just saying, hit that subscribe button slash membership button. I don't know which button, just do it. Pause. Ladies, I'm making a hard sell, I know. This entire time you're like, but like, what about his abs? Like, I need a man with abs. Abs. Bitch, look at him doing crunches. Girl, can you do crunches weighing 470? I didn't think so. That guy's got abs, his abs got abs. And those abs have abs. Unfortunately, there's about a phone book thick layer of body fat between that shit and the skin. But nonetheless, he's out here working. There's an unbelievable amount of ASMR value. There's something cathartic and soothing about watching Kyriakos Grizzly just exist. <laughs> he 
he he posted these videos. These are all from his channel that he posted personally, or whoever his team. His team, team. I think he ate a few members of his team. <laughs> I like the bunny hops. It doesn't seem like he's trying to get max altitude. It's like a sumo squat jump, also partial. Curious. You know, like, uh, you pray to God back in like the f-ing Greek days where the Greek gods are real and shit, like whatever, 3,000 years ago. And like, sometimes they'd be like, yeah, 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 here's a good harvest. But sometimes they're like, ah, sorry, this volcano blew up and killed everyone in the f-ing village. Uh, the gods have been described as mercurial in nature. Um, that is the perfect description for Kyriakos Grizzly. Um, what sense can you make out of these little mini squat hops? Well, let me ask you a question. Um, what sense can an ant make of a design for a quantum computer? None. It's orders and orders of magnitude outside of its cerebral capacity to understand. So when we try to understand what Kyriakos is doing and you you think, oh, I'm going to watch a Dr. Mike video and we're going to laugh at Kyriakos together. He's so silly. He does these silly things. We're silly. He's not silly. There's a method to what looks like madness to us. Oh, f- yeah. I thought I had full range of motion on my upright rows. Holy shit. This is called front raises overhead 10 times 100 kilograms. I mean, look, it's an absurd lift for seemingly no purpose. First point. Second point, by the way, 100 key is basically two plates on a side. That's like 225, it's 220. If I see a mother manhandling to above head height, 220, 225 in the gym, I'm not with that guy. Kyriakos could pick up a grown man and just throw his ass aside. F- that. The guy, the, his crew is amazing. The guy behind him is like, yep, it's just another day, another day, another dollar. You know how we tell you on this channel to control the descent to get the most muscle growth? Apparently we're wrong. <laughs> That's the reason I love that. The, the clap is incredible. There must be some sarcasm baked in these guys. Oh, Christmas colored weights. Let's see what's going on. Oh, we've seen this exercise before. This is kind of not so much load for Kyriakos. Uh, he's had even more before on their hanging. The gut really comes in uh, handy for this. I'm, trust me, I have a gut. These lifts are easy when you have a gut. If you don't, you're not really a man, so who gives a shit? F- yeah. F- yeah. Not a terrible movement for various forms of athletic development. His his profile view from the side there is sexual. My God. Oh my God. I didn't think the shit could get any more absurd. Behind the back momentum wrist curls with straps on. Again, I reveal my mortality and small brainedness with the question of why? There must be a reason I simply can't comprehend. Oh yeah, low bar partials. He's like, okay, okay, I'll go down a little bit further than a third of the way down on this last rep. Dump, victory. Hey, that's like Ronnie Coleman used to do. The way I would describe his lifting is if you wanted the minimum muscle growth possible for the most joint pain possible and the most inconvenience and lifting possible, this is how you would do it. Again, you, because you're not a god like Yuriakos. Is he wearing jeans? No, no, those are sport pants. This is where I'm supposed to grade it, right? You guys ready for my grade? Out of 10. Whatever I say next will be the end of the video. Consider that my statement out of 10. God is real. See you next time. If you guys like that video, YouTube thinks you're gonna really love this one over here. So give it a click and go down a fantasy K-hole of endless YouTube videos.